Oh, yep. <laughs> Here we go, Pisces. Okay, so what's going on? My name is Gabrielle De La Garza, aka the New York Doctress. Today we're doing your RN reading, which is your right now reading. So welcome to your appointment. If you're new here, hi, welcome. Um, if you're not, a hi, hope you like the new hair and let's get right into it. So yeah, that's a, that's not a great start, but it's a start. <laughs> so I feel like, okay, exactly that Pisces. I feel like not a great start, but it's a start. So maybe somebody, I, I feel like maybe somebody was like coming back to you to like maybe say if I mean I'm just gonna use this as an example it doesn't necessarily have to be the situation could be but doesn't necessarily have to be but like maybe somebody came back and they apologized for something um and the apology wasn't great but it was a start so I'm getting that um or this could be you obviously vice versa take what resonates leave what doesn't so let's get right into it immediately I'm gonna be so honest with you I just came from cancer and I feel like um, okay, so I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna pick up on what I'm getting So it's odd that I would bring up another sign or another person so soon in your reading so Pisces maybe somebody moved on to somebody else really quickly or maybe somebody moved on with you really quickly and they're still talking about their ex or this is you because and I'm also getting to maybe somebody actually had cancer because it was just something that like ran through my mind. So that could be something. Maybe somebody had that or is getting over it. But um, this could be you or somebody that you know. It doesn't feel bad or anything like that. Like I feel like this person is still alive. Like could have gotten through it. That type of thing. But um, but but I don't know why. Like why would I bring them up with you? So I'm also getting that too. So maybe somebody's bringing up somebody else around you, and you're just like, why would you bring them up? Or like, maybe I, I'm getting like this has something to do with your ex. Like I feel like maybe someone's bringing up your ex, or or because it. But it seems a little catty. Like I'm almost trying to figure out if the person you're talking to. It, I, I don't know. I, I just want to be like, like, why would you say that? Or why would you do that? Or, or the person that's telling you something is telling you about somebody else that said something. And you're like, why would you say that? Or why would they say that? Right? Because it feels like it's a little bit further, but it's also very close to home. So it's like someone's telling you something about somebody else that said something about you is what I'm getting. But you know about it. Right? So if you don't know about something, then, then it, this message probably isn't for you. Um, I'm also getting too that this person shouldn't be brought up right now like something's like too soon Something's too soon like why like it's just too soon right now. I want to say that it's too soon Okay, um, like I feel like maybe someone shouldn't be getting married or shouldn't be getting in a relationship this quickly Okay, or you're watching this all go down But something was messy. I will say that something was kind of messy for sure. But are you just bearing witness to all this? Okay. Justice. Okay, so this card also came out previously. Alright, so you look good. I feel okay, so you could be wearing a waist trainer as well. Like maybe you're trying to work on your figure. I mean, you gotta see this girl. Look at her. She's like, so just be careful. That I, but I feel like you look great, actually. This looks good. You could actually be promoting these um, or looking at people who are promoting these and saying, I want to try this out. Um, I feel like whatever it is that you're thinking about, this looks good. This could even be some type of surgery. But I feel like you also, but it seems like you're trying to do this the natural way. Like maybe you're trying to work out. I, I feel like whatever you're doing is working and it looks really great. I mean, the justice card, that looks, that's amazing. Okay, so this is what I was getting earlier. This is what I was trying to avoid earlier, but there's definitely a Libra hand. Okay, there's a Libra around in general. So like this could be something to do with like a Libra, Cancer, and a Pisces, or like the people that are in this sort of like group that I'm going to be doing at this time. Um, I did say it felt a little messy, Pisces. It's weird. I feel like I'm, a, I'm, I'm sort of like, I want to go into this slow. Like I'm... Wow, Pisces, what the fuck? Yo, this is crazy. Your life is crazy right now. Is it like, this? Is, I swear I just did a reading just before. This is not, this, this is not, didn't happen, this did not happen. Okay, okay. 
we need to slow <laughs> i really slow down i just want to get to know you um pretty nothing so i feel like you could be interested in somebody um i feel like maybe you were trying to like avoid love or i don't know it feels wild right now Pisces. you could be trying to take a step back but i feel like it's impossible you can't step back from what's going on right now because it just feels like a whirlwind like something feels like a whirlwind of emotions so either you're doing really amazing with the empress card and the justice card but i'm getting someone else's around i feel like you have a, like this other energy around you heavy right now so it could be a libra um strength 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 i feel like spirit's like okay no be strong with something we gotta switch decks i'm like i'm ready to go all in where are we gonna look okay let's go so, okay what's going on with pisces i feel like even you're like <laughs> i'm like nervous to, okay so something's going on with work where you're working on something or you're working with something you don't want me to talk about it i feel like <laughs> Okay, there he is, the Knight of Wands. Oh, yeah, I knew it was messy. I knew it was messy. Thank you, Spirit. Okay, Knight of Wands and the King of Pentacles. So there's two male here. There's definitely a Libra and there's definitely a Pisces. So we could even have like a four-way thing going on here. Um, it looks like there's definitely a marriage here. And then, but I don't think you're the married one. That's what I'm getting, Pisces. I don't think you're married. There's another couple that's married. I don't think you're married. And then I think you have someone else on the side. So you could be dealing with someone who's married and then dealing with somebody else. And then I, it's just wild. Like, okay, if you really want me to go all out. So yeah, male, female, you, and then a knight of wands. You could be, the side person could be a fire sign. They could be either an Aries, Sagittarius, or a Leo. Oh yeah oh yeah but I feel like something about work something about work One, two. so I feel like you're somehow getting out of the way or like you're getting like a get out of jail free card so this could actually be somebody bailing somebody out of jail literally like maybe somebody got in trouble but I'm also hearing too like you like like somehow you, you, I'm hearing you literally dodge, like you literally dodge a bullet. So like maybe something happens and like literally you dodged a bullet in your life or like metaphorically, like you're dodging a bullet with this one. Um, maybe somehow you're not getting caught with something or like someone can't find enough evidence or this is you. Like maybe you're trying to find something on someone, but I feel like you're the one that's sort of being devious. I'm going to be completely honest, Pisces. Um, I don't feel like you're being bad. Yeah, Queen of Cups. Oh my God, there you are. So finally, so I feel like maybe you finally show up somewhere or like maybe at first you were sort of taking a step back to like assess a situation like like a Pisces does. Like you're not about to sit there and just be like chaotic. Like, come on now, we got to like scope shit out, see what's going on, not get too emotional, right? We got to just see what's happening. And then I feel like you show up, show, you show up strong as anything okay so you could be dealing with someone named sean um but yeah i'm getting something like i feel like you just come in like okay like i know exactly what to say i know exactly how to say it i know exactly what to do and i feel like you come with like a, a confidence that maybe you had like didn't have before when you were trying to figure things out i feel like you know what's going on there with you know what's going on there i was gonna say you know what's going on now but spirit said there so you know what's going on there, wherever there is. Five of Swords. Yeah, but you're, you're being very silent about what you know, which is good. The hangman. Yeah, I feel like you're not going to let somebody get something out of you or you're not going to give something away right away. You can blackmail on someone, but like you're not. Like I feel like I, or someone's trying to like blackmail somebody i feel like i'm actually i'm like literally getting that i'm actually getting that that someone's trying to blackmail somebody or like do something to like just be petty as fuck 
it, it feels catty. I feel like maybe someone is able to say something, but I feel like it doesn't end up having an actual effect. So if this is on you, I feel like it's not gonna actually affect you at the end of the day. This could have been something that happened a long time ago and someone's trying to bring it up now and you're just like, <laughs> you got two cups, you're like, yeah, <laughs> we should have brought, brought it up then the star, yeah, but I feel like you make it out on top every time. I love that. Okay, so wait a second, eight of cups, yeah, you walk right away. You're like, yeah, sorry, I can't have that conversation right now. Um, Or like maybe, I don't know, I see you being like, oh, who, me? No. <laughs> like, like, I feel like something happened a long time ago where it's just, it, I, I feel like you just walk, like, do you know we say this walk away scot-free? Like, I feel like you just kind of like get to walk away or walk out of something or just like, it, it doesn't affect you. It's not supposed to affect you. Yeah, I feel like you get a brand new beginning. So if you were in a relationship, I feel like you get a brand new beginning or if you were getting a divorce, you get all this money or you get the house, you get to keep everything, you get the custody. Like, I feel like everything ends up working out in your favor. I'm not just saying that, I'm saying it's in the cards. If you walk away properly, I feel like if you hold on too tight, that's a whole other story. But if this is any Pisces who like left something behind or like, tr like somebody did something bad to them and like maybe you did something back, but like not so bad. It wasn't revenge, but it wasn't not revenge. Like I feel like something along those lines, I feel like it's fine. I feel like you're not, um, this could be like someone questioning you with something or like someone else's girlfriend or someone else's fiance or something too I'm even getting, but I feel like there's no proof of anything maybe there were pictures that were going around originally but i feel like those are all deleted they're all gone they're all like nothing's there like i feel like you're not gonna find anything or something or they're not gonna find anything king of wands the moon yeah this guy had so many secrets okay so if you were with someone i feel like he definitely had a bunch of secrets um i feel like definitely texting other girls definitely with other girls we're going into a whole other situation right now um i feel like or this is you pisces Maybe you were texting a king of wands and you had to get rid of this. And I feel like you don't end up getting caught. It and it ends up working out in your favor. Um, I feel like maybe it was just a fling. It was just a one night thing. It wasn't anything too serious. Um, maybe this is like, I don't know. I'm just hearing some sort of like a secret relationship. Yeah, but it's over now or maybe it's not what you want or it's just, it. Well, yeah, strength. Like maybe you were really into this person but you realized it like, wasn't for you. I feel like it wasn't easy to walk away from this person. I also see you too, Pisces. I see you like going out on the boat. I see you having drinks at dinner. Um, I see you working out. I see, I see you sharing dinner with someone. You could even be like going back to the hotel, having a good night's like, you could be going on a cruise. This actually looks really fun. Okay, change it up. I'm hearing change clothes and go. Um, dun, 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 dun. I don't know what song it is, but I'm just hearing change clothes and go. So I feel like maybe you're changing multiple times during the day while you're out. This could be for dinner. Um, this could be to, so okay, maybe you're going to like a comedy club or a show. Um, this could actually be a concert since now we're able to do those things. Maybe you just bought tickets to something along those lines. I do see the temperance card here, which I don't necessarily, this is like one of my least favorite cards in this deck, even though it's supposed to be good. So maybe something that looks good on the surface actually underneath isn't really that stable maybe you're seeing this um or this is something that's going on in your life like maybe something that looks great oh i'm going on a cruise with my husband my boyfriend with all the kids blah, blah blah we're having a really great time but then maybe underneath it all it's you know the emotions aren't there or the feelings aren't there anymore i'm hearing anymore like i'm hearing it takes like a couple of glasses of wine like to even maybe still be attracted to this person or like to still like turn you on i feel like it's if that's the case for you and you have to be strong with this person or like you know you have to like think about other people to like turn yourself on like it's time to go girl you know you don't want to stay in that or or guy you know like it, it's it, you don't want to stay in something like that um i feel like the fire is almost burning up too i feel like there was a lot of love with this person but i feel like over time the feelings started to change but i'm going to tell you this spirit does that spirit makes sure that those feelings change because they don't want you to feel the same anymore so that you do move on because if you continue to hold on to those feelings or harp on those feelings or still feel the same you're never going to want to leave so you have to eventually not feel the same i feel like it's frustrating for you pisces i feel like maybe you liked feeling these feelings of course we do we all love being in lust or in love or loving somebody but i feel like at some point i feel like spirit wants you to take care of yourself something about this relationship feels like it just sort of ran its course potentially um with the strength card still being here um it heavily makes me feel like 
yeah, and there's a sword there. Like, I feel like Spirit wants you to pick up that Ace of Swords and figure out what your truth is. I've never noticed this in my entire life. I've had this deck for years now. And I have never, ever noticed that sword. I feel like it's time for you to pull that sword right out of the ground and walk on forward. Like, I feel like you have to face some sort of a truth, Pisces. Um, or it's time to tell the truth as well, too. Maybe you know something and you're just not telling somebody it. I feel like you're trying not to hurt your own feelings and somebody else's. But yes, yeah, something about this. It's time to work something out and, and get out before the fire burns or, or before spirit comes and is like, okay, time to come save Pisces out of this mess. Um, but I feel like you're saving yourself regardless. Um, I just feel like, yeah, the chariot truth. You are. You, you're you're going to get out of this. You're going to get out of this just fine. If you're, I feel like you're working through something right now. Um, but it's working it's it's going actually really well for you I'm actually hearing it's time for you to take your time I'm hearing right because I feel like maybe you've just been in the same spot like I'm, I'm almost seeing like this whirlpool and like now I'm almost seeing you like get ejected into another place or, or like into another Maybe you're going somewhere or like on a plane or a train. Or maybe you're leaving this. Eight. Maybe you went to go see this King of Wands or like went on vacation with him. Like I almost, I'm almost getting like a, like a secret getaway or something. Or maybe someone's asking you to do this. Like Pisces, come on vacation with me. I want to take you somewhere. Queen of Wands. Yeah, I feel like someone's married, but really has a thing for you. They really have a thing for you, but they really like their wife or their husband. And I feel like someone's confused about this. I feel like there's a lot of feelings that are flying around. I do feel like this is kind of messy. Um, but there, and there's been like a couple of long-term relationships as well, because I'm seeing this. I never put these two away. So I feel like you definitely have these two people who are really just stuck on your mind on a constant basis. Or again, this is someone around you, or this is you before ones. This just came up before. This is either you were married or you got divorced or you're with somebody else, or I don't know, or you make out while after the divorce but but look I feel like something like you have to rebuild the house or something like maybe someone destroys the house because you got it um I'm also getting that as well too it's like all right like someone tries to burn the house down because like you end up with it like literally like insurance shit or something along those lines um or just mad because they don't want you to end up with it <laughs> or this could have happened in the past or this is something that happened like your parents or something I don't know I'm hearing like some crazy stories but I feel like either way, you st you're like, I still got my clothes. I still got my job. Um, yep. There it is. Right, so something happens with the house. Maybe you end up, like, moving somewhere or living some somewhere different than you thought you were going to live. Like, maybe you were, like, almost closing on a house. But I feel like something crazy ends up happening. Look, the star card is here. So I feel like you're either healing from this or you come out of this, like, on the, on a whole other... Like, something that you think is bad at first where you're like, damn it, I didn't want this to happen, blah, blah, blah. Watch that shit turn right around with the star card, Pisces. You could be right on the cusp of Aquarius and Pisces, but Pisces, with that star card coming out, I feel like you end up, like, looking down. You're like, wait a second, I'm going to turn this right into a gold mine. I'm seeing something ha wow, like a whole new like you completely flip something. So maybe you sell the house, maybe you actually flip the house. You you make some like like sudden movement that like I want to say it saves your life. Like something saves your life. Judgment. Yeah, but you have to make the decision. 3 of swords. And this could be with a relationship with the King of Pentacles and the Knight of Pentacles. I feel like you have to make a choice with these two people. I feel like you love them both. You want to be with them both or this is what's going to end up happening. I'm hearing the choice is yours, Pisces. Death. <laughs> Till death do us part. But you got to pick one. I feel like you got to pick one. you got to pick something. It could also be with the Scorpio or someone with Scorpio heavy in their chart or this is you nine of cups but you make the right choice i feel like spirit's not gonna tell me what to do justice but you make the right choice but you have to make those you have to do the pros and cons and figure out who is it which one is it how am i gonna get through this but you make the right choice so just trust yourself 
All right, Pisces, I love you so much. I'll see you soon. We'll come back to this. Okay, we'll see what the fuck's going on. And I love you so much. Subscribe to the channel, like this video, comment down below, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.